This is where every top-level footballer wants to be after a long season. The Champions League final. Only two teams left in the battle for Europe's Premier Club competition. My name is Derek Ray, and I'm joined for commentary on this final tonight by Stuart Robson. It is Liverpool against Paris Saint-Germain. Well, what a night, Derek. Two great teams, a perfect pitch, a magnificent stadium, and millions watching around the world. What more could you ask for, apart from maybe different commentators? Starting lineup for Liverpool. Alisson gets the nod in goal. Andrew Robertson starts with Trent Alexander Arnold in the fullback positions. Thiago starts alongside Ruben Neves in the centre of midfield. And leading the line today is Diogo Jota. And here's how the lineup looks for PSG. Gianluigi Donnarumma begins in goal. Sergio Ramos plays alongside Marquinhos in central defence. And handed the task of playing up front today is Kylian Mbappe. And they're underway now in the Champions League final. We're about to find out which team is the best in Europe. Nuno Minj. Neymar. Now he must favour the cross. Great reflex action. Well, that should have been a goal. Mind you, it's a brilliant save. Neymar's corner is still dangerous. Hakimi. An exciting talent who has everything a forward needs to be successful. Stuart, what are you expecting to see from Mbappe? Well, just take a look at those stats, Derek. It paints the perfect picture for you. He's been so clinical in front of goal and just one away from equaling that record now. I can only see him adding to his tally today. Tremendous intuition to win it back. Diogo Jota. Robertson. Now that pass easy on the eye. Able to get his body in the way. And deciding to go short with this one. It's not a bad ball. Well, the danger is still there. And the keeper making sure there were no scraps for them to feed on. Thiago. Salah, let's fly here, can they put it away? Oh, it comes to nothing in the end, really should have made more of that.
Nuno Menj. Neymar. Verratti now. Liverpool with the ball once more. Alexander Arnold. Crossing possibilities. Salah. Big chance. And effectively parried away by the keeper. And it could be a chance for Liverpool to take the lead from a corner. And they fancy a short one. Van Dijk, and with the goalkeeper. Marquinhos. And it wasn't a great pass, was it? And space for Liverpool in the wide position. Neves. Here's Fabinho. Oh, good work to deny the opportunity. And the danger is averted. Messi. Now with Hakimi. Well, he needed to read it to get there, and did. Could be a chance to break here. Fabinho. And Thiago looking very positive on the ball here. Are well, they going to forge ahead? Well, fantastic reflex action. No potential danger. Save, but still a chance. Well, good defending. Clattered out of there. Now far from a smooth challenge. Now, will the referee produce a card? Well, he's gone into the book. Well, he was late, and he deserved a booking for that. Messi. Oh, lovely, incisive pass. And a goal! Well, as you can see from the replay, it's the perfect through ball from Messi. And what a finish from Mbappe. He gives the keeper absolutely no chance. It's such a powerful strike. So, underway again here. 1-0 the score. Well, in terms of added time, a minimum of one minute. Salah that's useful play Neves here's Thiago can they cover up that is that for the first half here Forty-five minutes separating these two sides from glory. The second half of the Champions League final begins. Beautifully disguised ball. And the goalkeeper expertly anticipated that through ball. Minch. He's given it away. Diogo Jota Andrew Robertson Liverpool have given it away 
Renato Sanchez. Hakimi. A wonderful intervention. Renato Sanchez. Messi. Mbappe in the centre. And the danger cleared. Verratti. Verratti! And a goal to increase the lead in this final. Will they be stopped now? Well, as you can see, he doesn't mess about here, does he? He's strong, well-balanced and skillful. That's a top-class finish. So the ball rolling again at 2-0. They've given it away. Hakimi. Now with Messi. Kylian Mbappe. Verratti. Opportunity here. And hunting for his second goal tonight, however. Well, you're absolutely right. He's been on great form today. That was another good effort. It's Neymar's corner. And the keeper had plenty to think about with bodies around him. Luis Diaz. And this is Diogo Jota now. Robbed of the ball, Mo Salah. Mbappe. Well, an attempt to forget all about, unfortunately. Yeah, got it all wrong, trying to pass it into the corner, opened up his body, but didn't make the right sort of contact. PSG have decided to make a double substitution. Virgil van Dijk. Well, we're inside the final quarter of an hour now. And after that fantastic effort, it's gone out for a throw-in. Here it is now, a substitution. PSG are going to switch things around on the personnel front. Robertson, and the cross didn't beat the first man. And with the goalkeeper. And unable to keep possession. Making use of his physical strength to hang on to it. And PSG will have a throw in. And they're making a change. Substitution it is for PSG. to play it to 
It's there for him. In it goes to rubber stamp it once and for all. Well, here it is. 1v1 against the keeper, and the outcome was never really in doubt. He never looked like missing that. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. And room now out on the wing. Across the byline, a goal kick as a result. <laughs> Kylian Mbappe. And the electronic board has been held aloft. Three additional minutes here. And that is not going to help the cause. The header well off the mark. And he takes it away. Full time! Parisian pride shines through. PSG have cleared the final hurdle in the Champions League. Well, just look at the emotions out there. Joy and relief on one side, despair and heartache on the other. But we've got the right winners here. They fully deserved it on the night. For these players, well, it's the night of their lives, and they're determined to enjoy every millisecond. Well, they have to make the most of this, don't they? It's a great feat. What an achievement from them. Well, they don't need to be reminded about what comes next. It's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. The Champions League winners, Paris Saint-Germain. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. What would a celebration be without the chance to enjoy it with your own supporters? Well, these fans have certainly played their part, haven't they? They'll savour these moments. They've travelled far and wide to follow their team. They're loving every minute of this, and why not? They deserve it. A performance of fire as well as ice. They held their nerve when that was necessary. And these celebrations will run long into the night. Well, these are the moments they have to make the most of. It doesn't happen very often, does it? These will be photos to cherish for years to come. Brilliant stuff. And you are looking at the best club side in Europe.